all these guys are, uh, as you say, all around the world. Um, Simon and Francis in the States, and two, contrib two, two contributors in Sweden, and other people dotted around the UK. In the main, they recorded themselves. Nick Kershaw also yeah. recorded themselves. Musicians are so tech savvy these days, and usually have their own recording setups. So quite a lot of it has been sent in. You know, internet and all that, sending audio files, and it's been an exercise in building in files from other people. And Dave has been very helpful on this, Dave Kirchner, 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 yes, uh, indeed. Who, Great working with him. He recorded Simon um, and got us together with Francis Dunnery as well. Yep. Uh, been a huge help. Thank you, Dave. Supper's Ready, which we've uh, gone at again from 1972, Foxtrot. Um, there are two keyboard players on that, and um, you've shared some keyboard chores with Dave Kirchner on it, the, the 9 8 section. He did, he sent an entire solo in, lots of lovely keyboard work actually. Sorry Dave, I didn't use every last drop of it. My ego wouldn't allow me, we discussed our ego, <laughs> wouldn't allow me. But you uh, interjected at one point, a um, part that's not on the original recording. Yeah, um, there is a point where guitar kicks in and does something which is off the map, it's not part of the original, but uh, we like it anyway. So, um, uh, And there are extra guitar bits that happen just before the 666 big... Uh, big moment at, at the end of some guitar atmospherics working a little bit like um, distant violins or or, or or strings. It's a, it's a sound I'm, I'm fond of, so it's not up front heroic guitar work, but it's it's coloration at a distance and it's and it adds to the arrangement and makes it sound broader. I think. Of course, you worked with Simon before. Yeah, you contributed some guitar work to Fast Forward the Future a couple of years ago. So he's not a brand new acquaintance, but um, pleasure to have him on board, eh? Great. He's a great singer, great drummer. Um, uh, he's involved in this uh, purely, uh, you know, in a, in a vocal capacity, but um, he's done a great job on it. Um, he sound, he's amazing sounding. So it's really great. I loved working with him before on, on his stuff. A great album, as it happens. Fast forward the future it's from. So fantastic. Um, Dave, who, who worked on... Um, Simon's recording also introduced us to Francis Dunnery. Yes. Something of a surprise, a uh, late comment to the album was a Francis. Yes, I think, I believe he was working with Francis already and then he suggested that Francis might be right for Dancing with the Moon at Night and sent us a version of it on spec which sounded spectacular and uh, I think everyone that's heard that has had the same reaction. They said, yeah, as soon as you hear that, um, the opening strains of it, the a cappella unaccompanied, uh, vocal, the Scottish plain song bit, it's like hairs on the back of the neck, it uh, sounds, sounds great. Um, later this month, um, October the 27th, I'm going to be joining both Francis and Dave Kirstner on, in Cumbria on the, on the 27th. It's a children's charity uh, for, for, for kids who've got terminal diseases, so I'm really looking forward to being part of that.